well, mm, uh, well, this time we have Brooklyn for this. <sighs> well, this this reading was interesting and because because uh, well, in our book uh, we have a picture with a landscape, but that's not the only thing that we can see. Um, if we look closer, we can notice that the trees are broccoli. Um, what else? Um, um that the uh, well, we also can see that on the trees are on the trees are apples, but in fact they are um, bees. Oh, well, mm, well, we have to see. Uh huh. We also we can we also can see two mountains, but they are mm, they look like rocked, but they are loaves of bread. Well, ah uh, well, and we also can see a waterfall, and the water who is falling it's sugar and the grass is made of herbs and spices well um yeah it looks nice it, well um well in the other hand we have five questions and um, in the question one we have we have to answer uh, if the bread have or oh, what the what are all types of red? Oh no, the question is: What do all the types? What all types of red have in common? And I, well, I chose uh, all types of red contain yeast, which make the bread rise. The second uh, question is: What do the herbs and spices have in common? Well, I chose. Um, Herbs and spices but come from very small plants. The third question is how do peas grow? And I chose um they grow in pots. Each pot each pot contains several peas. Uh well the question for is where does sugar come from? And I chose the option C. I uh, uh -huh. Sugar comes from either sugar cane, a plant stock, or sugar beet, or root. And the last question is, what do broccoli and cauliflower have in common? Well, I chose both vegetables are in fact flowers. Well, yeah. Let's see about broccoli first. Well, as I said before, I think it was an interesting reading, especially when we when we have a closer look on the under pic on that picture well that's it